In this tutorial you will learn how to make different styles of gold gradients and you will also create the gold gradient effect on editable text in Adobe Illustrator. There is also a bonus in the end of this video so watch the complete video to fully master this skill. First create the background by selecting the rectangle tool from your toolbar. Click and drag the cursor on your artboard to create background. Remove the stroke color and set the gray fill color. This will add a nice contrast to gold gradient in Illustrator. Now lock this background. Now go to google.com and you can find a gold image on Google. Now paste it in Adobe Illustrator. This will be the image which we will sample the color from. For example, I want to make a gold gradient similar to this image. The secret trick to get color from this image is go to object and choose this create object mosaic option. Type 3 in both field and click OK. And here are all the colors related to golden gradient. Now create a rectangle shape so you can see how these colors looks as you adjust it. Select the shape and double click gradient tool in the left toolbar and the gradient panel will pop up. Now click on the white to black. You will see your shape filled with a gradient color. So the next step is to change the color to gold. You can choose sample colors from these gold image colors. Click on the first gradient slider. Then click on the color picker below that looks like the eyedropper tool. And click on the gold texture image mosaic to sample the first color. When you click on this mosaic you will see the gradient changes its color based on the color area you clicked on. Repeat this process for the second gradient slider. As you can see now there are only two gradient sliders. So the gold color is very soft and smooth. If you want to make a smooth gold gradient use colors that are in the same tone. For example if you use this color you will get a soft smooth gold effect like this. And if you want to make a more metallic gold color effect use colors that are in high contrast or mix light and dark colors in between. Now you can click on the gradient slider on the gradient panel to add new gradient colors and use the color picker to sample more colors. If you want a more metallic feel mix the light and dark colors together. I will add the color code in the description of this video so don't forget to check that. You can also rotate the gradient slider on the shape and change the orientation. You can save the gradient to your swatch so that you don't have to create a new one every time you need to use a gold color. Open the swatches panel by going to window menu and choose swatches. Select the shape filled with the gold gradient and you will see the fill color on the swatches panel change to the gold color. Click on it and drag it to the end of the last swatch color or pattern. Select the new swatch. Click on the swatches library menu and choose save swatches. Once you click save swatches you can name the gradient as gold and click save. It is important to name it so that later you can find it easily. Now you can find custom swatches from the swatches library menu and user defined option. Now that you have your gold color made you can easily change the object or text color to gold and create the gold effect. Filling an object with a gold gradient is pretty straightforward. All you need to do is select the object and choose the gold gradient. However, making a gold text effect requires an extra step. So I am going to show you an example of adding a gold effect to the text. Once you have created the gold gradient, there are only few steps to make text gold in Adobe Illustrator. First choose type tool and type your desired word. Select your text and remove its fill color. Now open the appearance panel by going to window menu and choose appearance. Click the add new fill button. Now click on the square next to the word fill and here you can select your gold gradient. Once you have applied it you can edit the gradient or the text as you wish. To add a shadow go to effect stylize drop shadow. Make sure to turn on the preview option. Now increase or decrease the opacity and set the below values as you want and click ok to apply this effect. So I hope you have learned all about gold gradient effect in Adobe Illustrator. Don't forget to subscribe the channel for more upcoming videos like this.
The bonus I mentioned earlier in this video is that you can download this complete file from the link given in the description of this video. So don't forget to check that and also give me a favor by subscribing to this channel. That's all in our part 39 of Adobe Illustrator Zero to Hero Complete course and I hope you all have enjoyed it. Please subscribe if you want to master in Adobe Illustrator. By the way, if you have not seen our earlier videos, please take a look. This course is especially designed for those who are brand new to Adobe Illustrator. It covers everything in full detail. Link is given in the description and first comment. That's all for today. See you in part 40.